All right, everyone, a quick update on Flux here. So Flux is another one that we haven't covered in a while, but we're going to look at it really quick here. So it's up 23% on the week here. Uh, another asset here that broke the uptrend, came all the way down to that final support level, the 786 here. Uh, did dip below it, of course, but 43 here. Got a nice little bounce going here. We're back above the macro 236 and the low to the high 618. So as long as we're over 58, uh, this thing is still trying to push higher. We're currently at 60. And as uh, of course, as long as we're over the macro 236, that tells us that 786 support level was the bottom here. So as long as you're over 53 pennies, the bottom is in. And the next big stop to watch, as long as you're over 53 to 58, is going to be the macro 382 here at 76. So this thing should move up another 25% here, even though you can see every time it comes up, it's selling off here on these candles and these wicks here. But ultimately, that momentum has come uh, are trying to come back in here. So once the stock RSI here, if this thing gets above the 50 level here, then you'll know that momentum's in and we'll look at these higher targets here. But you're not bullish on flux here until you get over 76 or over that macro 382. So just keep an eye on those prices there. Let's move this up to where we are today. So from 60 cents, how high is this thing going to go? We do have our target on the chart here at about uh, 665 at the 1272, a new high. Here on this gate IO chart, it's going to give Flux here a $2.3 billion market cap and a good decent 11x out of this thing from today. So what are your thoughts on Flux? None of this is financial advice, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.